A button that we frequently reference is called our auto service or timeout button. This button is located in our panel at the far left of the panel. Pressing this button one time will advance the mode to the next selection. From the top there's a red light and the red light indicates what mode it's currently in, auto, service, or timeout. Pressing it one time will simply go to the next one. Let's talk about the three modes of auto, service, and timeout. While the system's in auto mode, this allows the system to run its auto configuration, its programming. This will allow schedules to run day in, day out, and let the system pretty much be hands off. In service mode, this allows the system to have a technician working on it and not have to worry about somebody controlling the system remotely. While in service mode, the app and remote controls for the pool will not work. And last but not least, we have timeout. Timeout allows my technicians to add chemicals or do certain things to the pool and ensure that the pool will run for three or four hours after they leave. While in timeout mode, the system is locked from any kind of remote input. However, as soon as the timeout mode is concluded, the pool will go back to auto and run its normal schedule.